like to talk about the shapes of Jeff Banks suits, and they vary. And the reason for that is when I'm actually creating a collection, we devise a different block pattern for each different shape. So the blocks have subtle differences to them. It might be the width of the chest, it might be the type of shoulder line, it might be the width of the lapel. All of these little variations go together to make a block. And in the main, I'm normally running about four or five different blocks in any one season. So the first of these is my all-round classic Jeff Banks London block. And that's what Hilton's wearing. So it's actually got a semi-deep shoulder pad to it, which actually gives it a very defined shoulder line. The pad extends just a little bit beyond his bicep, so it gives this very clean cut, efficient look to the shoulder. There's still a little bit of a slope here, so there's an element of informality about it. The jacket is quite long, so it's a traditional length, and actually on the waist of this, there's plenty of relaxed movement. So again, for somebody who's a mature body shape, this is the ideal silhouette. The waistline of this jacket sits almost in the natural waist. So this has got a natural look over the chest. It's got a natural look through the waistline. The sleeve is not too narrow. It's fashionably narrow, but not too narrow. So it can actually engage quite a bold bicep, somebody that's been working out. So if you're looking for the all-round classic London suit, this is the shape to go for. So this is the Jeff Banks Brit suit. And the shape of this is very modern. It's narrow on the shoulder. There's the minimum of padding in the shoulder shape, which actually makes it look very contemporary. The lapel is narrow. It has a notch lapel, two button, single breasted, the waist is lifted slightly higher than natural and there's a lot of shape in the body and it's cut shorter than a normal jacket. So all of this gives this very Jeff Banks modern look. It's based on the modernist movement of the late 1960s when jazz was at the era of the day and everybody wore suits of this kind of shape. It's a slight take on British fashion, British styling, British tailoring, but it has this very modernist look about it. That is Jeff Banks Brit. This is the Jeff Banks Ivy League studio suit. Now I call it the Ivy League because it's named after the Brownstone Universities of America. Back in the 50s, the Brownstone College students they actually wore this kind of soft, rounded look of jacket, and this became the thing. So here, we've actually got very little shoulder pad, which gives this really nice, easy shoulder to this particular suit jacket. The lapels are different shapes, some with a peak lapel, some with just a notch. This one is two buttons, single breasted. The jacket is slightly shorter than usual, which gives it a very modern look and the sleeve is very narrow, tapering very much at the cuff. So this is the silhouette of Ivy League. The waistline, again, is slightly lifted, but it's slightly boxier than some of the other silhouettes that I do. So that is a traditional Ivy League shape. So the suit I'm wearing is our Soho tailoring block. Now the tradition of Soho tailoring, going back almost two centuries, was that all of the Savile Row suits weren't actually made in Savile Row. They were made across Regent Street in lots of little workrooms above shops and above arcades. And that was where the tailoring for Savile Row was actually carried out. So I've actually created this block, which is halfway between my modern studio block and halfway between my classic London block, and it falls between the two. So it's actually got a slightly soft shoulder to it. There is some shoulder pad. The shoulder is slightly wider than my classic block, so it's got a very relaxed feel about it. The waist falls in the natural waist point. There's roominess in the jacket, so it actually is a very comfortable suit to wear, and it's got a kind of relaxed, easy informality about it. This is one all to itself 
if you're looking for that slightly informal, relaxed suit. This is Soho Tailoring.